The blank of Vladimir Nabokov is one of North America's literary giants has thrown the spotlight. So let's let's look at that right there. Thrown the spotlight. So this person's in the spotlight. They're someone big. They're known. Okay, now we want to look here at the first blank. And we want to see here that we have three words. Stigmatization, answer choice A, which is a negative word. That is to have a negative association with something is stick to be stigmatized. Now we can see that the spotlight has been thrown on someone. Is that a negative thing just because the spotlight is thrown on you? And the answer is no. So we can't choose such a negative word. So we can get rid of A. You may not know what B means. It's not that common of a word. C, marginalization. Something's pushed to the margins. It's not that important. It's the opposite of something that's in the spotlight. So that's clearly not the answer. So of course the answer has to be B. Lionization means to hold something up as a celebrity or something great to treat as someone very important and hence when someone's in the spotlight they're typically lionized so we have the first blank what about the second blank well literary gains has thrown the spotlight on his peripheral activities and notice by the way that oh they threw peripheral in there maybe thinking that you've matched it up with marginalization because they're you know, similar but no it's the person himself is being lionized his activities though he has activities on the side here not his most important activities, but they have served to blank his efforts as an amateur entomologist. So you can see that because his spotlight is on this literary giant, there's my spot, wonderful spotlight coming down. Because that's so great, this is his literary genius, we'll say. Other stuff that he does, hobbies such as being an insect collector, entomologist, he actually likes butterflies, you can see that this part now is, is somewhat illuminated as far as the metaphor goes. And so we need to find a word that kind of says, oh, some of that spotlight is also on his efforts as a, as a bug guy, as an amateur bug person. So we look here at answer choice D, which is foreground. You put something else in the foreground, it's also here as part of the spotlight. And that's why D is our best answer. E, transcend means to go beyond. It's not transcending or going beyond his literary genius. So that doesn't work. Uh, and then, of course, F obscure is the opposite of what's going on here. So we end up with B and D.